yeah, 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 people, how you doing? Hi, and I know you're feeling good the same way I am. The crowd is wow, and everything is moving just as expected. Yo, I'm Rocketina uh, right here on EAD TV. And uh, what are you expecting today? Yes, I know you're expecting a lot. So, uh, when you get to look around, you find you, you find out that the place is so colorful, people are there, everything is just moving on so well. So, I want you, I, I want you to do me one favor, all right? Just follow me a little, just follow me, because uh, we'll have a lot of people right here. You, you, you get to experience a lot of things out there. The rapping session is going on, and uh, trust me, we are not going to back up on you. So, I guess you're not going to back up on me, and uh, actually, I'm going to bring in some other people for you, which you will have to meet. Stay with your host, yes, Rocketina is my name, and don't you forget that, and I'll be back with you in a jiffy. people i told you the ground is getting wet oh sorry i choose to do that okay but right here i'm together with a brother from another mother he's the md hey you're looking so fly man <laughs> so, yeah so how how are things going man it's, it's it's awesome already and it's going to be awesome and more awesome over and over again Okay, as a music director, yeah. okay, what is happening right there on stage? What can you say? Because actually the crowds are actually feeling the vibes and a lot of things are actually going on. So, as the music director, what are you going to say to what is actually happening on stage? Okay, right now it's actually um, the rap battle and then we have a couple of rappers that are on stage battling themselves and spitting real, some, some, some real hot bars right there. So, that's actually what is wowing the crowd and amazing everybody. And subsequently, we're going to have Awesome performances, guys. That's definitely going to wow the crowd. Okay, that is uh, from some of the uh, 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 artists you actually invited right on the floor. So tell me, judging from the crowd, what are you going to say? Are you going to say that uh, entertainment is at its own uh, in plastic state, or you are going to say uh, at this point we are still upcoming? I think entertainment is underrated in this town, actually. Like, 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 like we have the illest performances in this show right here. So if there's anything to be said about um, entertainment in in this state, right, it is underrated, and this show is going to be a living proof that entertainment in this place is underrated. So you're going to see a lot of mad performances, a lot of crazy ass performances, and we're. We really have plans for you guys, don't worry. Wow, well, I really like that. He said that entertainment is actually underrated yeah. on the face of the plateau. And then what can you say about levitation in general? Levitation is basically the illest, the, the, the sickest concert of November in J City. So, after everything, after the, 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 the show and the performances and everything, you're going to see how dope this show is going to be. I promise you, don't worry. Okay, as a music director, what is actually going on on stage? So, what are those vibes? Can you give us right here? So that the people will be able to feel, to say, okay, as a music director, he's here, he's ready, and then at any time he can stand up on stage and then battle who's he wants. Oh, don't worry, I'll give you vibes, but not here, I'll give you on stage. Don't yeah, worry. I promise just, you. Yeah, <laughs> don't worry, just, just keep your eyes on stage, keep your ears open, no distractions, and just listen to what's happening on stage. You're gonna feel me and my crew on stage, I promise. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was actually wondering, asking you about the crew, but I can see that everything out there is so, is so, is so set, and then uh, the sound is very good. The stage is well organized, and then everything. So, what can you say, uh, as a, in a form of a word, what can you say to your crew? How can you define your crew in general? Excessively talented human beings. Wow, that's what they are. That's what they are, and you're going to see it. You're going to see it. I promise. I'm not. I'm not over exaggerating. You're going to see it. They are talented set of human beings. That's what they are. All right. So we look forward to seeing you on stage. You know, trying to put things in order. Yeah. All, right? All right. So thanks for coming, man. You're welcome. <laughs> you. All right. <laughs> so people, I told you we're going to meet a whole lot of people, and that is the MD, the, the uh, music director on uh, Levitation. Stay with me and don't go nowhere because in the TV I'm going to bring another person. You're going to feel the vibe. I'm happy, and I hope you're happy too. So don't go nowhere because uh, I. Have another person for you coming okay, all right people i told you i'm going to be here with another person again so i'm together with gilbert all right as you can see him is looking so fly you look so fly bro uh, <laughs>
<laughs> nice one. So, um, as an artist, as an artist that you are, uh, tell us some of the things in which uh, you get to think before putting things out there for your people. Um, well, first of all, I appreciate you having me on this red carpet right here. And second of all, to your question, yeah, um, there's just this dynamism to art and you just can't deny that fact. And we the creatives always try to go to the spine to bring out the in-depth of what we can relate to our audience. Now that is our message, that is our picture being painted on canvas. That's the only way we can relate our message to the world and that is what I'm going to be doing right here on the stage, Levitation. Alright, so you are telling your fans to expect nothing but the best out of you today? Not the best out of me, but they should expect a part of me. Wow, so the best of you is yet to come. The best of me is always with me. I, I agree to that, but um, how do you get to blend between music and, uh, and the painting? I guess that's what you do. So how do you blend? Don't you think that one is a bit of a stress? Um, well, there's nothing you cannot do as long as you set your mind, your heart to it. And, um, okay, what the music can't actually say, the painting says, people have a way of talking with it, rather than just the words. So when the words are no longer there, the painting is there, the image is there forever. Mm. So what inspired you to do both the painting and the music at the same time? Um, well, as I said earlier, that's the best way can, I can find expression. Yeah, um, there's a lot of performance art. You get music, um, poetry, rap and all of that. But this is who I am. This is the best way I explain myself better to people. Yeah. Yeah, I agree to that. And people, this is Gilbert. My brother is looking so fly. And um, judging from the crowd, you see, what are you going to tell your fans out there? And what should they be expecting from you? Um, I said that already. <laughs> but anyways, um, they should expect a part of me. Every artwork I put out there is always a part of me. And I give nothing less than that. And a part of me is a whole of me. That's just it. Wow, this is Gilbert and um, he's an artist and also a painter. Look up for him because right now I'm about to go in there to go see what he can do. So, what well love, bro. Thanks, man. Yeah. Okay, this is ATV Life and this is the red carpet on uh, Levitation right here in the Open Theater in uh, the University of Joss. So, I have the first lady right here on uh, on the red carpet. So, I'm looking. Oh my god, you're looking sick away. Thank you. <laughs> of course. So, um, judging from your outfit, it looks like you're here to have a lot of fun. Sure. So, what can you, judging from the crowd here and then judging from what is going on upstage, what can you say about the program in general? It's a nice program, like this first time I'm attending and I like what they are doing. So, do you have it in mind to uh, attend a lot of programs like this? Sure. So, when you heard the name Levitation and then you saw the invites and everything, what prompts you in order to come out here to uh, uh, have fun with each and every wonderful person that is seated here? <laughs> well, I've, I've not been to such gatherings like this, so I got the opportunity. My cousin is performing, so I said I should just come and support her. Alright, so do you love music? <laughs> you love music? Yes. So, what, of, what part of music do you like? <laughs> every kind of music, every part of music, I just like So am I permitted to call you a jack of all three? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I thought as much. So, uh, this evening you are out here to get one. Did you come with some friends? Mm, yes. Yes, I did. Yeah, and, uh, and then I guess they're there catching phone and uh, I, I love your cap. Thank you. Yeah, so you're looking so fly. Alright, so I will be looking for uh, more of uh, the jubilation and everything from... Uh, you understand now all the smiles and everything like that so uh, about the um the rap battle what can you say about that it was not what i expected <laughs> you like uh, you were expecting something less and then you got something bigger 
Yes. So, would you say University of Jones have talent? Very. All right. So, you as a person, if you are to have the opportunity, they have what line of music will you do? Will you go with the rap, or are you going to change another style? No, another style. Like. All right, another style. All right. That, that that's beautiful. So we'll see more of you later. All right. So enjoy the uh, enjoy the uh, show. All right. So people, that's the first lady right here on the red carpet. This is a TV and uh, a lot I installed for you. So hey, look out and then enjoy for yourself. All right, beautiful people. I told you it was a rap battle. Okay, so I'm with Flair. Yes. Flair happens to be uh, one of the contestants of the rap battles that just uh, 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 finished right there off stage. So, Flair, how you doing, man? Yeah, that was a nice one. So, uh, tell me, what part of uh, the rap did you uh, 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 actually enjoy the most? No, the the whole thing, because like we most of I didn't come with like the intention to particularly win. We just did it for like the hip hop culture. Look how many people are here because of rap. You understand, but so we just did it basically for the hip hop culture, for 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 promotion of rap. And you can see people turned out in their mass. So yeah. All right, that was massive, man. So uh, uh, at the cost of uh, uh, the, 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 the the battle, yeah. right? At the cost of the battle. There were a lot of faces you met. Yeah. You met incredible people. Yeah. So what makes you feel like uh, you are that kind of a person that stand out special to reach to the finals? Well, um, honestly, getting to the final was was just grace actually because I'm not when it comes to battle rap. I'm not really a battle rapper. I'm more of a performing artist. You understand? But so when it comes to this, I just got here because um, I have the people on my side most times. But I really didn't think I'll make it this far actually. You understand what so thank you all right coming up as the second position yeah. how did you feel how was your reaction back then on stage i haven't thought of that but see second second position is just the first loser so it's not like but, but as i said it's not like we didn't do it as by competition you understand we don't hate each other so for me to fake that i hate him now nah, now nah. so we just did it for fun you understand so so coming second is great it's actually a good honor but yeah so, did you look at yourself as a loser? Not necessarily. Yes, no. because I can see greatness <laughs> in your face. Thank you, Paul. Yes, this is Flair, and then he came second in the rap battle. Oh my god, I was so happy for you. When I heard it, I was a kind of, oh my god, I. Mm -hmm. Can I be opportunity to come up stage to come and challenge you people? <laughs> yes, because talking we, we, we is talking we know how to do best, and then at this particular yeah, point, yeah. Uh, uh, rapping and music is what you know how to do best. So these are the kind of uh, lines of entertainment we do. So I say bless up, and then uh, I know that the future is great, and then the career is up higher. So thanks, Flair. Yes. So this is a uh, TV, and then you heard from the man Flair. All right, it was a great battle out there. So see you more because uh, a lot. I installed for you. <laughs> On the red carpet, I have an artist. Yes, I think this is the, the second artist I'm having on stage by the name Lalo. Lalo, how are you doing? I'm fine. So, uh, uh, coming out here, expecting to perform, expecting to wear the crowd. And um, um, aside that, what else can you say you're out here to do? I'm out here to have fun. You're here to have fun, like to dance, like to do the thing like never before. Yeah. So, Lado, tell me, why do you choose music? Nah, I'm not a musician, I'm a poet. Wow, we are a poet. So, why do you choose poem? Because I love poetry. You love poetry? I can see that from your face. It's written right on your forehead. <laughs> so, Lado, tell me, what, what are you expecting after this program? I'm just expecting to have my mind blown because levitation is like something that just keeps happening to your brain. It doesn't happen to your, to your person. It happens to your mind. And I just, I just, I just want everybody to happen. I just want to, my mind blown. That's all. Okay, so I guess you 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 blow the minds of people through poem, and then what kind of a poem do you do? Do you actually tell people on the things happening around, or you uh, uh, do imaginary things? Well, I do a lot of I do a variety of poetry. I do love poetry. I do um, social ills poetry. Anything that goes wherever the inspiration comes from, you just take it like that. Okay, so you wish to give me some? Nah, you just wait for the one on the stage. No, I I I, I feel I need something different. Something for my ears, something for the viewers out there. Okay, uh, alright. Levitation. Betwixt touching the ecstasy of the clouds and fighting gravity strong enough to sabotage the claws of the earth. Levitation. Caught in mid air, I'm long 
been ensnared by this box shaped bands of violence. Two box stops, I am broken. Alright, so she actually called me Levitation. Do you believe that? So, what can you say to your fans out there? Do you have something to say to your fans? Well, I don't know if I have fans yet, but if I do, then I love you all. Because I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you wish to boy, give a shout out out there because I'm handling the mic over to you. Give a shout out to those people you love the most. Can I dance too? Yeah. Okay, I, I want to give a shout out to Dele, my cousin. I want to give a shout out to my brother, my sister, my friends. Success in University of Joss. My grandma, I love you. <laughs> so, why do you dance at the cost of your grandpa? Because I love, I don't know, she's like, she's, she inspires me so I have to like... Wow, I envy you the most. So this is Lado. You need to watch out for the best of her right there off stage. So, Lado, what do you have to say to Rocketina? You guys are awesome. You forced me down here, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> All right, see you around, Lado. <laughs> So beautiful people, I'm together with, uh, <laughs> should I say, a hero. So, um, to the people looking at you, uh, how do you intend to, to introduce yourself to them? Okay, so um, basically I'm mostly known as Siren, but my real name is Armstrong Booga. And I'm a rapper, a songwriter, a should I say partially a singer? <laughs> I don't know, I? I'm partially a singer, I'm a computer programmer and I'm a blogger. Okay, so are you performing in Levitation show this evening? Uh, no, <laughs> no, no. I just, I'm on the low for now. Alright, so you're here to get inspired by a lot of things out there. I'm here to, I'm just here to watch and learn and, well, put it into good use. So, judging on the things that happened and then the things that are happening and the things will continue to happen. So, are you getting some inspiration to say someday people are going to uh, look up to you to say, yeah, this is my mentor or this is my star? Okay, well, um, first of all, Levitation is it's going on well. It's kicked off well. I like the idea of them starting with a rap battle and the rap battle was really energetic. It had the crowd going. So, any performances from there will just keep on going with that vibe and then well I think this is this is a really great program for me to be in I'm really happy to be here because I feel really inspired and I know that yes definitely I will be on this platform maybe next year and other bigger platforms all right so what word do you have for the rappers out there okay so for the rappers out there um well you just have to keep on you just have to keep on pushing on man. you just have to keep on pushing on and they want to write every day writing improves improves and also try and read reading improves your vocabulary improves your wordplay and a lot of things i do that in my spare time in order to help myself to grow and as for being a better freestyler you just have to do it even though you might come short of words or you might allow me to say hook you might hook sometimes but you just have to keep on doing it it helps you get better and better yeah that's nice so can we have a flow okay can we have a flow um in my life i have to make choices and at the same time i hear voices in my head two voices to be precise one is good and the other not nice but still i have to hear voices gotta clear my head live out the noises i like that bro i like that nice one siren and uh, see you around and then we get to hook up a little and then oh, dance yes, dance yes, a little man, <laughs> this is my city your city i am here you can hit me up anytime all right that's beautiful all right. thanks for being around bro right, so thank yeah you. this is ntv and now i'm here with uh should i call you the brain buster or something like that this is Dele, the man behind uh levitation so uh, tell me i'm eager and i'm curious to know what is the brain behind levitation uh, levitation came to me while i was having my bath wow when you're having your bath yeah and I, I think it was born from a lot um a long history of my foundation as as an artist I have one rule, I never perform anywhere if it's not live. So I felt like why not give more artists this kind of platform to perform at? So and then here we have Levitation. So the love you have for music, the love you have for a whole lot of things you do, and then the love you have for people around is what inspire you to put this up. Exactly. Alright, so uh Dele, as um the artist that you are, alright, what line of music do you love? Ah, uh, I love alternative rock. Oh. 
I love alternative. I love actually listen to as many genres of music as possible. But I love alternative. I love heavy metal. I love um, indie rock. I rock. I love folk rock. I love R and B. I love whatever. As long as it's music, I can learn something from it. If I do matter, I have something to teach me sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> I'm telling you. Sometimes I listen to like, hey, you know. <laughs> All right. So can you give me a tune? A tune. Any yeah, tune. Any tune. Freestyle. Anyone? Uh, okay. Uh, God. Sorry. Long. <laughs> cut this part out. <laughs> cut this part out. <laughs> All right. Um, as an artist that you are, what are those challenges you face, and then what are those challenges you're still facing up till now? Okay, I think number one, the just music industry is heavily divided. That is one. Everybody is in a competition against themselves, which is a funny thing. Number two, there's the obvious challenge of these Buhari times, you know? <laughs> and then number three, I guess sometimes having people that really uh, have the same passion as you and want to work as deeply as you want to work is a hard thing to find sometimes. So those are just a few of the challenges. There are a lot. But then we're pushing through all of it. Yeah. Because what's the road if it doesn't have challenges, you know? That's true. That's true. So, um, actually, aside music, aside uh, uh, music, right? What is that hidden talent you have? I'm a physicist. Wow. And how do you combine those together? It's difficult, but I do. I do. I rest like that. <laughs> I rest like that. Yeah, you know, there are times that you have a carryover, but then <laughs> still you push on through it. You know. But like, all right, beautiful people. I don't feel like leaving this place, but hey, I have to. Okay, so allow me to enjoy the show. The